Hey guys! So today I have my blue light glasses on, so that's why it's this weird reflection going on right now. But I wore them because I feel like it makes me look smarter because we are doing a toy review on, do you want to say what it is? It's uh, called this. The Hoverstar Motion Control UFO. UFO. So it's basically like a drone, but for like kids, I guess. Um, but there's no controls. It's actually you are the control. So your hands are the controls. So there are um, four, five sensors. There's one right here, one right here, one right here, and one right here. So like all on each side. And then the one on the bottom, I believe, is this one. This little black thing right here. Um, so. Basically, what you do, it, we'll, sh we'll give you, a, we'll show you what it does. It's interesting. We haven't really, um, we're not the best at controlling it, but we try. So basically, the sensors, it tells them when it's getting too close to something, and it kind of will like get it like repels and goes the other way. And so you can kind of, I guess, confine it the best you can. Although we're not experts at it, we just got it like Fourth of July, but we've only used it like once. Um, we did do it outside. This is the first time we've done it inside, so bear with us. Uh, bear with us if I can even talk. Bear with us if it is a little bit crazy. But and, and also our bird is here, so oh, that's the bird. Don't want to get scared. Jackson, just be careful not to. <laughs> and I wanted to. We'll try not to let it hit the bird. All right. Um, this is the charger. Little standard charger. You could plug it in your to your computer, or you could just um, do normal, which is this find the adapter and mm -hmm. then just charge it from. Yeah, normal adapter. Yeah. Um, so, anyways, here we go. We're gonna show you how to do this. Um, so you turn it on, press it two times, that button, doo -doo, right, and then it'll start blinking like this. Um, and then, yeah. I think you're supposed to hold it on a flat surface. And then you just turn it up and then. And you turn it up, and then when it stops blinking, doo -doo -doo -doo, and it's green, then it's ready for play, right? All right, so we gotta stand up to do this part. Oh my gosh, this scares me. Here we go. Ready? Okay, throw it up in the air. Oh, I'm gonna this chair. Okay, throw it up in the air, and we'll try to control it. Go. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, ready? Calibrating. Okay, don't throw it up too far. Oh, oh, mister! Okay, uh -huh. <laughs> I'm gonna do it again here. Let's try to do it this way. So, you catch it, and if you want it to stop, you have to turn it upside down, and then it will stop moving. So, that's basically our little, um, as you can tell, we're not really experts, but when you put your hand in front of it, yeah, it'll kind of try to move away. Let's try it one more time. Ready? Okay, ready. So throw it up, closer to the camera. Oh no! Oh my the bird! <laughs> it's still going! Okay, oh my gosh. Can you guys see that? <laughs> so it's it's interesting. Um, we have a lot of bugs to work out, but it's really fun, especially outdoors. It's really fun outdoors. Um, we had it outdoors and there was like, it kind of would like, I felt like it was attracted to like trees. the bushes and the trees. Although I don't think it's gonna get stuck in a tree. It doesn't go up that high. It like works it works better outside. It works better outside. But we didn't want to do this outside because um I don't know. It would be too bright for the camera. Yeah, probably too bright for the camera. But you guys get the gist of it. Let us know what you think. And uh, and if you get one, let us know if you figure out how to control it better. They sell um, it at Costco for $17. My mom got it at Costco for $17. I think I saw it on Amazon for $22. So, yeah, Costco is the way to go. Costco is the way to go. Um, that is it for today. All right. See you guys later. Bye.